Hey guys, welcome to Farming Simulator. So, we're here on the Manchester map again. I uh, do apologise for yesterday's video. Either not getting up completely or uh, being very late. Because <laughs> as of yet, it's still processing. But you guys saw the video. Uh, it's kind of irritating the second time I've uploaded it, so I don't know what's going on there. Uh, new mod. For me, anyway, it's been out for a while. Conveyor belt mod. Awesome mod. Uh, we'll start this guy up, actually. Bring it back there. Okay. Uh, yeah, I put this guy to work. Of course, the course is gone now that it was on, but... Doesn't really matter. Take the handbrake off. Because sometimes it will crash. Doing that. Uh, this guy's still got its course. Spreading the poop. So we'll load it up and get him going one more time, I guess. I am very much thinking about getting a European trucking game. Why, you may ask? Well, or should I say, what's wrong with the truck you have now. It keeps on screwing up on that trailer I have. The trailer is a modded one where you can change the colour. Yet it screws up on it and it's driving me up the freaking wall. And the only trucks I know, well that I actually like and I have, are the man trucks that work great. So I'm thinking about putting that on there. Uh, there's no American trucks that I know of that are good, no honestly, and that aren't just straight Convert conversions across. I know the Kenworth W900 just came out, but I'm not a fan of it personally. You know, just the styling of it, and the fact it's very much Euro truck sim. I don't like when people just take stuff from that. It's probably mods that aren't there in the first place. So it kind of gets to me. So instead of scooping, spending hours doing that. And just do this. So yesterday's video was shorter. Hopefully you see it, but time. I got a strong suspicion you won't. Yeah, I think you can set a course play for this. I'm not a hundred percent how it would work though. So something I may ask Raven about. I know Ian's got some tutorials on it as well. Not necessarily that though, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure, I'll have to have a look-see. New trailer mod too, I uh, may do a mod review on that. It's one of the best out there right now. But, I don't know yet quite yet. Mm, get back on course, jeez. Uh, I cannot remember what I was going to plant in here. Play nearest it should go. Yeah, so pretty much does one full row and almost half. It's the biggest muck spreader in game right now. Just getting rid of the muck to be honest. This guy here. This is the culprit we may get rid of. I love the look of it. I really do, but it was having a bitch of a time just collecting grain from this. It kept on going in circles, and you watch the way it turns in a minute. With this trailer. See? Slow down, and it uncatches from whatever it does. Or well, it may. See, it's almost like it's getting caught, cool, but I don't get why. I, I want to keep it. There's so much about it that it drives me up the wall, so unfortunately. It's got to go. The steering is a little funky in this too. See the way it leans? Of course it's <laughs> designed to do high speed turns or anything, but still. And we have this on the dedicated. It's never bugged me to this extent. I don't use it much, mind you, but... 
So we're just going to have to have an input. It's not one I'm going to keep around for eye candy either. Not trucks. They're too expensive. Sell this, we may need to add a little bit of money, I'm not sure. We will see. Wave goodbye to this and say hello to the new rig. Well, for this game save anyway. So if you guys know of any really good American trucks for farm sim that isn't just a convert straight across like that, I, know, I think this one even is, but I know Raven tweaked it a little and what he did I cannot remember. I'm pretty sure we're not going to have enough. Well, yeah we do. Um, which one is it now? 120. Hopefully I got the right one. Nope, this is a new version. Ah, oh, we'll run with this. So this is a new version of the game. It's got like a... Uh, new version of the game? New version to the farm sim. It's got like road going tires. Instead of being the tractor treads. Yeah, it needs to be refilled again. Like I say, it does pay me to use this one, but it functions. It works well, too. Not a big fan of the tyres, mind you, but it'll work. I want to get that combine going uh, right now, it's harvesting oats. If that's going to be the cornfield. Uh, like I've explained in the past, this isn't my usual gameplay one where I do I try and keep it more to on camera. Well, I am now anyway. But this is one that I do play quite a lot off game, off camera, so there are gonna be changes. And I'm just playing for fun really. So me adding money is I'm not playing for a whole lot of realism aspect in that form. I had a course place set up for that thing too. God damn it. That's full anyway. I'm pretty sure I didn't. I don't think I saved it. It was only a very, very rough. Yep, no. <coughs> no, I think we just come back from it too. So we still have 30 in. We'll leave away the kennel of the field. Is this one always going to be corn? No, I don't know. Anyway. We'll always be around here. Start recording. So right now I'm just bringing the speed down before doing anything. How many have we gone? One more. Okay, break. Make the turn. So you want to at least leave a good two gap, I think, still. So you'll start one, two, and then you can do your turns. Sometimes I leave it a little longer. drive along here. Start slowing so we don't overshoot like I did when I was using the Peterbilt. That thing's got awful brakes too. Turn in. It would pick up on the trigger. So I'm not tipping it. You don't actually need to tip straight away. That thing moves so much. <laughs> I 
come back the way we came pretty much and because we've got all this grass over here I'll just roll to a stop stop it uh, we will sit well actually we'll get it to run drive course First of all, we'll stop it because I don't know if it was the right one. Now we'll drive course. Should eventually pick up on the combine. Yep. I want to see how it does. So these are kind of like little <laughs> course play tutorials almost. Ah, let's go. Of course, I did have for it's gone as well. So, me doing this, I can actually do the right hand work. It's field six. I believe that is how I had it. Nope. Started over there, yet it's this far off. That's interesting. I was going to 15 meters. That'd be why, though. Must have hit that and accidentally hit it. Now ah, we're pretty much on. Go off on its way. Back to this guy, stop. See, I got a lot of calls cool pound to get right now. I wasn't going to keep using the manual, but more as well. It's free fertilizer. <laughs> Sad part is you don't actually get anything best back for doing it, using it, kind of thing. You don't get better yield, as far as I know. I really just suck a may, as I have put this on. It may do something in a modded map, so I probably put the best grain in the field that we can make more money out of. That would probably be, uh, I want to say, oats, but I think it could well be wrong. Uh, da -da -da. Ooh, they're down. <laughs> down quite a lot still. Actually, barely. Oats, yeah. So that's, that's filling up. Trucks are okay. We'll try starting this. So I don't know what freaks this out and causes the game to crash. I've just been taking the handbrake off as soon as I come in game with it. Let it start, let it do its thing, and uh, it's usually okay after that. So I'll keep this straight, we'll get to the end of the round, we'll guess drive it back down maybe. So the only thing that doesn't get dirty on this is the edges of the wheels and the teeth on the gear there. Or oh, sprocket, I think it's good, I don't know. And the idlers there, that... I can't see why he's done that. It's because they'd be getting worn, they wouldn't be getting dirt on. But originally when this came out, it wasn't one that get got dirty. So, whoever retweaked these made all of the crawler tracks get dirty. I'm guessing. I'm guessing a lot of them didn't get, didn't get dirty. Oh yeah, where was that? 
So this only goes about four miles an hour, it's pretty slow. So the Pazzo, one of my favourites. Cedar that I use anyway. I think we'll go over that some really too worried. So it's done quite a few passes. You should have seen course play when I had it set. It would have taken forever, I just wanted it to be dirty. Let's go. And all realistically. Some of the smaller fields may use it one day. I love that. <laughs> they fold over pretty cool. Drive us back down to the loader. Actually, screw it, we'll drive the loader to up to here in a minute. Set this guy going. So right now I don't think we have anything for corn. Pretty much like the other map window. So I do see a few comments from time to time asking for the links for the mods and the map. The map is uh, from Mod Hoster, not this one, the one I have been doing normally. And the John Deere's they're using there, again, from Mod Hoster. 90% of the stuff I'm using is from Mod Hoster. If not all of it, in all honestly. Uh, this map I'm on now, Manchester map, from BC, Canada, is from American Eagle Modding. These are all stock that I'm using right now. It's from their own web, uh, nev mod review on it, so you can get the link there. Same with this guy. That there isn't a download link for that I'm willing to give anyway. You're almost done, so I'm guessing that one's working a treat. I just kind of looks nice in one of those type of tyres. I, I wish he had that tyre on them though. Instead of these. These look kind of nasty in my opinion. How much? Manure I've got left, probably not much. Uh, manure. 24,000, yeah, we're almost out. It's probably about to be too soon. As soon as we're out, we're out, I don't care really. Working on the cows. We had uh, over 200,000 liters I guess it is in that pile and it's pretty much killed it. It's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. Not a big fan of doing the meal manual. Uh prefer the slurry. At least you can have the tank on the side of the field that you don't have to keep going back and forth, back and forth. Like this. I think I'm just gonna stop it there and refill it. Once we get that bunker pretty much full, close enough, we'll uh, probably buy up some more cows. The game gives you that uh, ten. I maybe look to more more towards like forty mark, maybe a bit more. Let's 
The laser gets red there. Wonder why it's that colour. Interesting. Alright. Why are you. Really? What are you even doing? Oh, I wonder if you're going to the stop point. Do it again. Looks like we are going to need to redo that course. Maybe start it over there and bring it through the field. Should be okay again to now. So, you know, we're not going to be able to do full pass, but once we're out, we're out. And then we'll park this guy. May even invest in a pressure washer, clean it off. So soon. I hate it when it doesn't. Oh well. Like I say, when you're out, you're out. That's waiting for the truck. Where's the truck? Just tipping now. Alright, this little guy. This guy's perfect for this. So you don't need to keep the tractor on to keep this guy going. It's just the way this is piled. Instead of being like a pip, it was just easier to keep the tractor on there and back it up if needed. Until you found that sweet spot. So we're going to put up the controls, so there goes the truck. Speedy Gonzale. Uh, Leveled it up. Bring it down. So this will be good for the silage. Stuff like that. That's what I plan to use it. You'll lift up and I should. Maybe just drive. So I've got the weights on from uh, MB3D modeling, suitcase weights. Uh, it's on Mod Hoster, but I think they're a bitch to find. But they fit on this, so kind of fit. You, you can go for the full length, well, just uh, that type of weight and that would be all it could have, probably, realistically. And we will... Uh, jet wash this once so we have one. So for now, don't know what the jet wash will be, neither. For now, we'll just park it around here. Actually, jet wash could probably. Oh no, that building's useful. Yeah, I don't know. This is where I had it parked earlier. Oh, 
Oh man, slipping is probably right up against the tree. Water tank, I'm guessing these have the water mod. Oh no on. Actually we'll need this connected still. So. I wanted to get the jet wash that is uh movable on the pallet. Using the telehandler. In doing that would allow me to move it and put it right against the building like it should be. So for now again I'll park this tractor and trailer down by the conveyor. So I'll probably tuck it around out of the way around here somewhere I imagine. When I do get it, probably next to the water tank or wherever the fuel is. Over there somewhere maybe. Oh, I hear it. Really. We'll dump the course anyway, it's need more refining apparently. What we can do, nah, uh, not quite. Let's get this guy ready. I want to hit space. Gotta love it when I see control is on the same as drive control. It's kind of annoying. Uh, de -de -de. This guy. So I think it was oats. And if you're wondering why some of the equipment is clean like this, when you know last time you saw it was filthy dirty, we had rain, and I kind of let the rain go for a while. And of course it cleaned a lot of the machinery. Even if the machinery is inside. Yay for giant physics. Load up the seed for this field, and I can't remember what side it starts. No, my luck is probably going to be. Oh. Just over here. Perfect. So, what I'll do is I'll just come along with the sprayer and spray the rest. Hopefully, you don't need to call for it. I cannot remember all the normal ones with this guy. First, it'll do it itself. It's easier. No, it's not. Uh, is it, no, it's it is oats. Okay. Last peas. I want to make sure it's putting the right thing down. Been through that once. Uh, yeah, we'll nuke this. This is going to be corn, but I'll need the corn planter for that. Everything's pretty much dealing with oat right now. <laughs> Other than my uh, crawler. I would fast time it too to get ready for the night, but the stuff's gonna grow otherwise now. Oh, really? What are you actually slipping on? I do not physically see any wheels spinning. Ok, 
Can you actually not make that? That's really weird. This is a real low horsepower track though. What I'll... What I'll do is it did start slipping. Is that little spout will grow but it doesn't matter. I want a fast time. I want to get it back into the daylight. So, well actually what we can do, is I don't know how many people know about this, is we can go to brief in, plant growth, off, go back, and we can fast time it. Ta-da! One dupe. I'm just make sure I... Yeah. <laughs> Just like that. I don't know how many people know you could do it. Another stop up on the brakes. There's a park semi tipping trailer. Then grab the low boy, load up the crawler, and we'll probably be at the end of the video. If we are, that is fine by me. Got any more menu yet? Nope. They're not really efficient right now, they're only at 35, we need to feed them silage and possibly water, but if that's the case, I need to hunt down a decent water tank mod. I know there's a slurry. Tank here that's been converted into it. And then I need to find out where I get water if it's a water mod. Raven's my best one on that one, because he knows he's used that mod and he's played with it in the past. And to whoever it was that said about the lime, thank you. Uh, I read some of your comments out in yesterday's video. The video that may or may not make it up. So it didn't fall on deaf ears, I saw it. Now I know who your name is, I can go through and look. Uh, I believe it's, you said it was on Facebook, you mentioned it. And if that's the case, then I should go look on there because it would be a ten times easier for me to find. I know you gave fairly detailed instructions, and yes I read them, they went in one ear out of the other. So this is a trailer by Big Moss Modding, uh, used to, you may guys recognise it, I used to use a blue one, but it began with S, I can't remember the name. Uh, yeah, this one you could change the colour and everything, they're coming up with a, an American version of it. It's probably going to be longer, I guess. But it is pretty darn slick. So if we do this... And do that. Come out. Hit do that. And... the lower the ramp of stone.
So there are a crap ton of controls on this. Some of which not being shown because I'm using a 360 controller, so. Ready. Oh, just so you guys get a feel of the control list. Yeah. There's a lot. So I put the extensions out so this doesn't have any issues. It can go up bed all day long without them, it's just the attachment, the cold vein on the back. Oh, and we're over the video. <laughs> the length. So we'll uh, pull this up and then we'll land it. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, hopefully you guys get to see tomorrow's video, if not real life farming video you would have seen that by now. So guys, I hope you enjoyed, and as always, catch you guys later, see ya!